Alright, let's still try to fish, though, while we're here. I like this zone. It's kind of cool. What was that? Don't get away from me, fish. Nope, you're not allowed to get away from me. I'm gonna catch you. Cod! I caught a cod! Neat! Everybody's always thinking. Got all this good linen. Sup? Your boy is back. Hoseki Quarry. Yeah, 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 thank you. Did you have to play on your controller? Uh, your controller. <laughs> your controller, Ash. Wow. Yeah. Well, I mean, it's your controller anyway, so there you go. We also found a pill bug. It showed up, and then it, like, immediately peaced out. It was like, sup? It was like, sup, and then it just took off. Okay. So what are you up to? Um, what are you up to? Sorry. Closing things. I just wanted to make sure that something went out today. It did. Okay. You thought it said a baby shrimp for a second? It could have been a baby shrimp. It could have been a baby shark. What are we doing here, Jasmine? We're at the quarry. We're gonna mine stuff. Got that one? This way. But there's more. I gotta wait for you. There you go. Get that coal. Alright. Uh, I'll go down if you go up. I don't think this is gonna work. No, it's not. Come down. <laughs> Your plan was foolish. Oh, hey, here's a dude. It's the first day on the job. I have no idea what I'm doing. No one's oh. training me. This place is falling apart. Oh. It's his first day on the job, Ash. Back to work, I suppose. Any over here? It's the first day on his job. I think I'm supposed to train that guy over there. I really don't feel like it. I've really, uh, I've been really tired over this past week or so. Can't sleep at night. Let's just hope he gets the hang of the job without my help. Wow, rude. Oh, this is probably something else we can learn how to do. Zip line. Oh, here you go, more iron. Typical cat. I'll go down if you go up. Nope, not coming up. You gotta come down. Mm. Look, I'm a good cat. You're the worst cat. I'm the I'm the best cat, Ash. You you go to jail. I can't talk to people, unfortunately. Worst cat. All right, you gotta get it together, Gregory. It's your day. Today is all about digging. Any problems you have, you leave it at the door. This is a new day. Big breath. Come on, Greg. Jeez. I'm not sure where we're supposed to go. Should we go this way first, or should we go up that ladder first? This way. Mushies. More mushies. Uh, yeah, we need this ability. We gotta find whatever teaches us that ability. Right? We got- there's apparently a couple of abilities we need to learn. We need to, like, learn how to pair- like... Uh, float. We also need to learn how to zipline. Who dis? My manager's really stressing me out. He told me to be quiet today. I shouldn't even be talking to you. When you- when you don't see the sun, you can imagine it's always me. That's what my boss says at meetings. This isn't Vegas. 
It's always noon somewhere, Jasmine. <laughs> it's high noon somewhere. <clears throat> Who that ninja? Management's coming today. I better make a good impression. I've been practicing my business face and all. Business face? Hopefully they notice me in all this darkness. From this mine to the from this mine to the boardroom. Moving on up. Moving on up. Wait, where'd you go up here? There's like a secret. Yeah, 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 yeah. Secrets. Secrets. Who are you? Oh no. Listen, I've been working here for ten years. I took this little hole a few months ago. Don't tell anyone. You need to play cool. You can't lose this job. I just can't afford to work that hard. My back really hurts. Take this. Call it a bribe if you want. <gasps> yeah, we got the glimps. We got the glimps. We got the glimps. We got the glimps. I like how this guy has like a secret hideout. We got the glimps. And the only reason why you can find it is because the wires go that way. <laughs> it's true. That's a good touch. Yeah. All right. We can't go anymore further because we don't have the, the, the abilities to do it. You know what we do have? The, the glimps. glimps. We got the glimps. Alright, we got some mushies. We got a lot of good uh, iron and such. We got iron and such. Alright, let's go to wherever we need to go to learn these skills, Jasmine. Okay, I think we need to go to another town. So, it's usually in towns that we can get these things. The problem is, is like, I don't know where all the towns are. <gasps> Wait, is this a town? It's a layhouse. Mm. It has shops! Go up. It's possible that's a town. Like, I wonder if we need to go to what's her name's parents' house again. Oh, this is a oh, that has pork chops. Oh, we should go there. Oh, <laughs> we're too busy um, doing stuff. Yeah, we should also go to uh, Gwen's house too. Let's go to the town. Let's get some pork choppies, and then we'll go to Gwen's house. How about that? Because I feel like Gwen's all like, "I need to be alone." No. Don't bother me. I'll be at my parents' house. Don't. Don't follow. <laughs> look. 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 We've been friends with Gwen a long time. We know when she wants attention and when she doesn't. Alright. So we're going to go to this town first. Get some pork choppies. And then we'll take the bus to uh, Gwen's house. What about this pill bug that we're going to be crossing through? Well, you'll see it when we, po when we go by it. You'll see how weird it is. We need to, you didn't wake up at all the people. Why don't you do it? Shoot, it's not my job to be the bed and breakfast. I'm a cat. It's not your job to do anything, apparently. No, because I'm a cat. Mew. I want to see this pill bug. There it is. Oh. What's your deal? Hi. Okay. He left. Yeah, I don't understand it. It's a lot of carrots. I'm just gonna plant this uh, lettuce. Oh, also, I learned that uh, Summer also really likes green salad. Oh, really? Okay. Yeah. Um, paella. Huggy time. Huggy time. Smothers butts, hello. Hello. I hope you're having a fantastic Thursday. Smothers Welcome butts. to the stream. All right. Um, let's make tea. Did you already feed this lady? No, I haven't. Oh, I can't feed her when she's. I can't do anything with her when she's doing that. I got a cup of tea. Can I talk to her? I'm playing music with the blades. There's nothing planted. I guess there's one thing planted. There you go. Furugawa Iron. Yeah, it's a little uh, town. Neat. You're a little town. I, the problem is, is I don't know if we're going to be able to get any more of these uh, stuff until we um, get new passengers. Because we only have the one token. Do you know what I mean? Tea's apparently worth mad money. <gasps> That's good to know. Hmm. 
Okay, we gotta go that way. Who dis? Who dis ninja? Oh. Hi there! Oh, he doesn't want to talk. I love a simple life. Wait. Look at this rice field! Uh. It's pretty! Uh. 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 <laughs> so close. Alright. Where is my brother? He should be here. Is there anything up here? Oh, there's a there's an owl. It's like an owl up there. Uh, I can't get up there. Okay. Okay. What are we doing here, Jasmine? I don't know. What impeccable timing. I I am in dire need of assistance. I can tell from your friendly and familiar face that you are undoubtedly the helpful type. Listen, I'm looking to complete this set of five traditional woodprints. They date from Yushiro period and as such are invaluable. Hmm. I found four of them, but alas, the last one eludes me. I am certain is in this very village. Furthermore, I am absolutely positive that it was recently in the possession of the local shopkeeper, Theodore, but he refuses to even acknowledge its existence. One irksome little man, raccoon, tanuki, whatever he is. But, with your help, yes, with that sweet smile of yours, and generally non-threatening attitude, well, I'm sure you can schmooze your way into acquiring that last precious piece. That would be the... That would be the last missing piece of this slippery puzzle. Well, go ahead, Skipper. I can't wait. Hmm. He seems... shady? Sure. Oh. Yeah, I can't get in there. Hmm. In here. Where is that time? I've been looking for him all over. He's been acting all sorts of strange. Oh, his uh, brother? I think he must have been a bad fruit or something. He, if you see him, you tell his brother that for him. Don't mention that. I'm extremely mad. Oh, he's Angie's. Hmm. These houses have, like, nothing in them. I've gone through all these houses hoping to, like, buy something or at least steal something. Nothing. Oh, well, hello there, customer. Is our catalog not to your satisfaction? Are you interested in some specialized items? Oh, a weapon, you say? Yes, yes, I know it. I sat in a special stock. I sat in my special sto stock for an eternity, and then suddenly everyone was looking for it. At first, it was this very pedantic person. Very rude. And worse, they were haggling on everything. <gasps> I, I didn't even tell him of the print. Gave him some junk instead. And then later, a giant walrus lady came in, demanded that I sell it to her. The thought crossed my mind, started a bidding war. But she offered me a serious coin for it. That lady, let me tell you, she was loaded. Anyway, that's all I know about it. Can't help you with print. But feel free to browse my wares. Oh, so someone bought it already? Sounds like it. He didn't necessarily say that she bought it, but... Bye. Sounds <gasps> Pork chops! Yeah, we should buy it, right? Yeah. I'll play like... Five. Okay. What's what's the seeds? Okay, rice seeds, leek seeds... Do we have leek? We used to have leek. Buy some. Buy like ten. Oh, we're out of money. Oh, okay, never mind. <laughs> Apple seeds and linen seeds. Yeah, the leek we, we, leek we didn't have. Uh, I could sell and get some more money. Oh, you can sell some of that tea. Because I'm, I'm growing one right now. Um, I could sell some corn. I could sell some coffee bean seeds. No, I'll keep the coffee. Yeah, tea is worth a lot. Huh. So is lettuce. I could sell some carrots. Yeah, well... Okay. Um... Anything else that we want to buy from him? Mm. Um, 
I think we're good. Okay. It's over here. Oh, this is where we get the new thing. Mm -hmm. Air glide! One out of two. So we need one more person on our ship. One more new person. No, thank you. I don't want to buy your magazine subscription or whatever you're selling. Oh. Oh, we have to air glide up there. Yeah. But okay, so this is the island we get the air glide from, but I think that still means that we need to kick off one of our current residents, right? Probably. Well, let's talk to this guy, tell him what happened to this, uh, the, the walrus took his stuff. Where is he? There he is. Ah, you're back. Did you manage to get my missing print? No, it was already sold, but how? Wait, is there a competing art collector roaming about? A walrus lady, you uh -huh. say? Of course. Of course it was her. <gasps> How dare! Oh, that horrid woman. That dim-witted, egotistical, patronizing charlatan. She calls herself the collector, if you can believe it. She doesn't even collect anything. Oh, I'm sure she bought that print only to spite me. I should have never told her about my collection. That ugly ass sack face. Wow. Well, I'm not going to wave away competition. The ugly witch is in hiding. In hiding from you. I, wow. In, in hiding from you. I don't specifically know why, but the news of a new spirit fair made her skitter away like a puny cockroach. How fitting. Wow. Yes, yes. You're the spirit fair. Tell me something I don't know. She should have known better than to tell me the location of her hideout, though. She's hiding these coordinates. Oh! Pay her a visit, would you? And when you see her, show her this figurine. She'll know. Believe me, she'll know. Oh. This? Oh, don't worry. It's just some junk Theodore gave me. Okay. I guess let's go to the coordinates? Yeah, I mean, I assume we need to finish his quest line to get that ability, right? Yeah. All right, so let's... If the coordinates are close, let's go get it. If not, let's go to Gwen's. Okay. Oh, thought we were further. Boop. The Collector. It's Benicio Del Toro, right? All right, 150, 150? Negative 150, positive 150. Ooh, there's some good salmon here. All right, negative 150, positive 150. Oh, it's way up here. Oh, it's past the ice line. All right, we won't be able to go there yet. Okay. Uh, all right, so, oh, here we go. We're here, let's go. Do you want to sell some stuff? Mm. Or do you want to just go to the bus stop? Let's bus stop, Gwen. Okay. Because I think that we need to get a spirit flower, which we only get once we complete a someone's story. Maybe. So that we can get the icebreaker, right? Yeah, we yeah, needed yeah, the spirit yeah. flower to get the icebreaker. You're right. Um, I'm betting that's how it works. A bisque. Ooh, a creamy bisque. Uh, let's, oh, pork chops. Uh, let's do pork chops with the- um, uh, Fruit, do we have a fruit? He doesn't like fruit. Oh, okay, then leeks? 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 Yeah, leeks and pork chops sound really good. There we go. I think maybe just cooking pork chops by itself also gives you pork chops. Probably. How long is it going to take? I want to give it to him. Oh, it's going to take forever. While. Yeah. Fine. Okay. Um. Oh, we're here at the bus stop. Oh, let me talk to him. I love Alex. Oops. Oh, because we didn't water that lettuce, so I only got one of it. Where do I go this time? Uh, so Gwen's house, I think, is right Was there. Was it this one? Yeah. Look at him go. You eat pork chops and leeks IRL? I mean, that sounds delicious, right? It sounds bomb. It sounds really good. Leek. All right. Leek. <laughs> Alex is the best. Alex is the best. I want more Alex dialogue. Right? Yeah, that's it. Sounds wonderful for Autumn. I agree. 
Me and I, I, um, I subscribe to Imperfect Produce, and we've been getting like a lot of new veggies and stuff to cook with. And uh, now that it's fall, we're gonna get like a bunch more like winter squash and stuff like that. We just got an acorn squash. I have never eaten acorn squash, so I'm like, I'm what do I that. do with this? Like, uh, granted, like Jasmine, uh, we, we me, ever since me and Jasmine have been together, I don't think we've ever bought a squash. But back, well, I mean, we we buy like summer squash. Back when I lived with my mom, yeah. like acorn squash and all these different kinds of squashes were a pretty regular occurrence. Mm -hmm. Just chop them in half, throw some butter in there, roast them up. Look, look, I'm not fancy, all right? I'm not fancy like you, Ash. Mm. Stella, I, I'm sorry. Mm. Sorry I even considered doing this. Ending your days as a familiar house is so cliche to boot. Mm. Or in your family house, familiar house. I can't explain myself either. I just wanted to finish it off, you know? Mm. To decide on my own terms how would I go. But not let myself be taken away. I've been weak. I'm sorry. Mm. Oh, the irony. Crap, I feel so mm. selfish now. Sometimes I wish I could have been like you. But rarely. <laughs> <laughs> oh, crap. Hug me now. Hug her. <gasps> Give her a cup of coffee. She's starving. Huggy times. Mm. Thank you so much. I needed that. You always pull through. Wait, you haven't eaten in days. Eat something. She's starving. Give her a cup of coffee. Mm. Oh. Uh, give her popcorn. Mm. Mm. Okay. Uh, okay. And now what she's what is she going to do now? I don't know. <sighs> I keep jumping. I feel like there's there's like one more like thing here that we need. Alright, here she goes. She's she going, walking. Is she going in the house or is she going back to the boat? Uh, back to the boat. I probably think. the boat. Oh, there's a dude here. Haven't we talked to him before? Uh, we talked oh. to him up top in the house. Uh, I've lost my house because of you. Your friend wasn't using it. It should be mine. I have rights, you know. Now that old shrew kicked me out. Back to being oh. the gardener. Jerry! But the biggest rub is my house is locked. I'll break that padlock and get my dignity back someday. Oh. Leave me alone. I have work to do. Oh. Oh. Poor well, Jerry. I mean, it was her house to begin with, Jerry. Come on. Alright. Is she back in the boat? She is. Okay. Let's go. Cool. She was starving there. She was just like, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be by myself. Don't worry, but, oh, I forgot to eat. Meat stew! All That's right, not so, pork chops, then. Yeah, let's just make one pork chop by itself. Okay. It's still gonna take a bit, okay. Yeah. So pork chops and leeks makes meat stew. I mean, that sounds really good. Okay, they're all sleeping. Let's talk to them in the morning. Yeah. Um. Do you wanna like make things? Let's see what we can upgrade, housewise. Um. No. What is we that? already have it upgraded, I think. None. None. We Lights. don't have that. We have both of those. We got all of our upgrades. Um, we need more linen fabric, we need aluminum, and we need bottled ectoplasm and glass. Wow. Um, the kitchen's already been upgraded, and the smith... Yeah, okay, so, yeah, we just need to do more stuff with the uh, Uncle Atul. Should we sleep? Sure, why not? Ah, yeah, there you go. Okay. She was intentionally not eating, given that dialogue. Yeah, I, I mean, like, she was by herself for a long time. We haven't talked to her in a while. <laughs> yeah, we, f we should build some more things. But I feel like she's definitely doing the whole thing. Like, I'm gonna go! 
Don't try to stop me. <laughs> I'm running away. I'm running away. You'll never know where I am at my parents' house. Don't go to my parents' house. I'm telling you guys. Uh, where do we want to go? Uh, let's talk to Gwen again first. Okay. Workshop. Workshop! Feed that to him. Alright. Uh, food. Pork chop. What? Pork chops! Oh boy! Oh boy! I'm so <laughs> excited! <laughs> they look so damn tasty! And they are! Sprout! You're a miracle, you know that? Oh, this is so good. Ah, now I feel a bit guilty. And I'm sorry for running all these culinary errands for me. Look, there was a kid at work. Craig. We used to have long and tight union negotiations. All-nighters. Everyone would be at a standstill. Everyone was so hungry and uh, every restaurant was closed. I would send Craig on these endless 24-hour grocery store crawls for me. I would uh, ask for these impossible gifts, saffron, sumac, or even anise. Uh, it was something like 2 o'clock in the morning. Our goal was to make the tastiest chops in the world. A meal for everyone, on both sides of the table, to calm heads and appease stomachs. The first part didn't always work, but everyone always was always well fed. I don't know how he did it, but Craig would always find everything on my list. I would joke with him, and he would have a break. Uh, I would joke with him that he would have to break into people's houses to get the stuff. Oh, geez, maybe he did. Oh, he might have. He might have. You know I don't know how you did it, Sprout. You made it taste like home. Aw. Here's to you and Craig. Aw, cute. All right. Do you need huggy times? He probably needs a huggy times. Every I think everybody needs a little huggy time. Come on, huggy time. There we go. All right. Ready to talk to this gal? One second. Let me finish this. I've lost count. I, I've lost count. I don't know how many have. Uh, it probably is just a few more. You don't know what you're doing. Uh, I'm making a lot of... There we go. Got it. 45 linen thread. Let's go. Mm -hmm. Look, this will come as a shock. But I'm ready to leave. I just can't fight it anymore. Listen, you know how I know that you're ready to leave? Because last time you were on the boat, you said that you were ready to leave. <laughs> But it's okay. I know you're with me. Mm -hmm. Bring me to the Everdoor when we where you met Jerry. I'm ready. I think. Okay. Oh. Oh, does she need a huggy time? Probably. Give her a little huggy time. Mm -hmm. uh, well, coffee. Give her one more coffee. Yeah. Okay, there we go. Look, we, we were like so busy trying to figure out how to pronounce Karen, Sharon, Sharon, Karen, that we just decided to name him Jerry. And the other door is there, so we could take the bus. Yay, we get to talk to Alex. Oh, it, it's sad to see that Gwen's gone, but you know what? That's just how life is. We can't stay forever. You know, though, and I expected that uh, promotion at Global, I generally thought I would succeed. And I almost did. If it weren't for the sickness, I could have made a difference. Mm -hmm. When I moved upstate, I had uh, to have my piano and my sewing machine transferred. So I just stayed there after to avoid the trouble. Everyone I went to, I ran to the McMillans. Mm -hmm. Chad always wanted me to get out and with him and his friends. But I just never happened to trust them. <coughs> They're douchebags. Mm -hmm. Well, I just don't use that word lightly. I just want to see her outfits. Yeah. Oh, she's ecstatic. Okay. Hades pronounces it care on. I can see that. I'm never gonna get it right. He's Jerry. <laughs> We're just gonna call him Jerry from now on, guys. Let's go. I love this bus driver. Alright, All right. lead us there, Ash. 
Okay. I'm gonna fish. I bet there's some interesting fish at the Everdoor. I bet there is. Bye, Alex. It was Alex, right? Alex. Never Alexander, though. Alexander's for chumps. Oh. 